Have you ever pondered about what truly constitutes the greatest glory in life? It's a question that can unravel a myriad of responses. Is it wealth, fame, power, or is it something more profound, something intangible yet immensely powerful? Let's delve into a thought shared by one of the world's most influential leaders, Nelson Mandela. He once said, The greatest glory in living lies not in never falling but in rising every time we fall. A simple phrase, yet it carries within it a profound wisdom that has the power to redefine our perspectives on life and success. In our journey through life, we are all bound to stumble, to falter, and yes, to fall. It's an inevitable part of the human experience. But the true essence of glory, as Mandela pointed out, is not in avoiding these falls. It is not about treading the path of least resistance, nor is it about seeking a journey devoid of challenges. The greatest glory in life lies in our ability to rise every time we fall. It's about resilience, about the inner strength that pushes us to stand up, dust ourselves off, and continue marching forward no matter how tough the road may seem. It's about perseverance, about the unwavering determination to keep going, to keep striving, even when the odds are stacked against us. This concept of glory is not about a flawless victory, but about the courage to face defeat and yet choose to rise again. It's about the audacity to look failure in the eye and say, you have not defeated me. I will rise again and again. It's about the relentless spirit that refuses to be crushed, the spirit that embodies the indomitable will of the human spirit. So, isn't the mightiest glory in life not about never experiencing failure, but about the strength to rise every time we fall? It's a perspective worth pondering, a principle worth embracing. Because in the end, it's not about how many times we fall, but how many times we choose to rise. That is the true glory in living. Imagine for a moment if we never fell, would we truly understand the value of rising? Let's dive deeper into this thought. Picture a world without setbacks. A world devoid of any failures sounds pretty ideal, doesn't it? But would it be? Would we truly appreciate the sweet taste of victory without the bitter tang of defeat? You see, it's the trials and tribulations, the stumbles and the falls that give rise to our strength, our resilience. Consider a tree. Does it grow tall and resilient without facing fierce winds, harsh weather or the occasional storm? No, it endures, it fights, it falls and it rises. It's through these experiences that it gains the strength to stand tall. We as humans are no different. We grow stronger, wiser, more resilient through our falls. Life is not a straight path. It's a road filled with twists and turns, ups and downs, victories and defeats. And it's these defeats, these falls, that make the victories all the more significant. They are not the end of our journey, but rather, they're an integral part of it. Think of some of the most influential people in history. Thomas Edison, Albert Einstein, J.K. Rowling. Did they achieve their monumental success without any setbacks? Of course not. They stumbled, they fell, they faced rejection and failure. But they didn't let these setbacks define them. Instead, they embraced them, they learned from them, and they rose stronger. So, when you encounter a setback, don't let it discourage you. Embrace it. See it not as a defeat, but as a stepping stone towards your success. It's through these experiences that we learn, that we grow, that we become the best versions of ourselves. As the great philosopher Friedrich Nietzsche once said, what does not kill me makes me stronger. So when you fall, remember it's not a defeat, it's an opportunity. An opportunity to rise stronger, wiser, more resilient. Remember, every fall is not a defeat, but an opportunity to rise stronger. Now, let's delve into the power that lies in rising, the power that shapes the glory of living. Imagine for a moment the strength it takes to rise. It's a force that comes from deep within, a spark that ignites the spirit. This is the power of resilience, the ability to bounce back, to rise again, no matter how many times we fall. Resilience is not just about getting back on your feet. It's about learning, growing, and becoming stronger with each setback. It's about understanding that failure is not the end, but a stepping stone to success. It's about harnessing the lessons learned from each fall to fuel your rise. This transformative power is not exclusive to a select few. It's within each of us, waiting to be tapped into. It's the power that turns dreams into reality, 
that turns the ordinary into the extraordinary. The power of determination complements this resilience. It's the unwavering commitment to rise, to push through the obstacles, to keep going when the road gets tough. It's the steadfast belief in your capabilities, the confidence that you can and will rise, no matter how many times you fall. Each fall, each failure, brings us closer to success. It molds us, shapes us, prepares us for the glory that lies ahead. Each time we rise, we grow stronger, we evolve, we inch closer to our true potential. Consider the butterfly. It begins as a caterpillar, crawling on the ground. It then wraps itself in a cocoon, a period of struggle, of transformation. But it emerges, not as it was, but as something more beautiful, more powerful. It soars, it rises. It doesn't avoid the struggle, it embraces it because it understands that it's not about never falling, it's about rising. So the next time you fall, remember the power that lies in rising. Remember that each setback is a setup for a comeback. Remember that it's not about avoiding the fall, it's about embracing the rise. So it is in rising, not in never falling, that our true potential is unlocked. Now let's make this knowledge actionable, because knowledge without action is just information. We've talked about the glory in rising, the power of embracing the fall, and the strength that comes from standing up again. But what good is all this wisdom if we don't put it into practice? Let's not let these words become mere echoes in our minds. Let's turn them into actions, into habits, into a way of life. Imagine a world where we view our setbacks not as failures, but as stepping stones to success. Imagine a life where every fall is an invitation to rise stronger, to grow, to evolve. This is not a fantasy. This is a reality we can all create for ourselves. We just need to shift our perspective. So how can we start? It begins with a decision. A decision to no longer let our falls define us, but rather how we rise. A decision to see each setback as a lesson, a chance to grow, a stepping stone on the journey to becoming the best version of ourselves. And then, it continues with resilience. With the determination to get up, dust off, and move forward, no matter how many times we've been knocked down. It's not about ignoring the pain or the disappointment. It's about acknowledging it, learning from it, and then using it as fuel to propel us forward. Let's not just dream of this life. Let's live it. Let's embody the spirit of resilience, of growth, of rising. Let's make the choice, each and every day, to rise above our challenges and setbacks, to learn from our falls and use them as stepping stones on our path to greatness. Because remember, the greatest glory in living lies not in never falling, but in rising every time we fall. It's a choice, it's a mindset, it's a lifestyle, and it's within your reach. So, are you ready to embrace your falls and rise stronger each time? Let's not just say it, let's live it, let's rise, and let's inspire others to do the same because together we can turn the world around. Are you enjoying this journey of understanding the true glory of living? There's a profound beauty in realizing that every stumble, every fall, is merely a stepping stone to the pinnacle of our potential. Every time we rise, we are reborn, stronger, wiser, and more resilient. This is a journey, not a destination, a deeply personal odyssey of self-discovery and personal growth. And what better way to navigate this journey than by joining a community of fellow explorers? By subscribing to our channel and hitting that notification button. You're not just passively consuming content, but actively engaging in a transformative experience. You're becoming a part of something bigger, a collective of individuals committed to rising time and time again to the glory of living. So let's embark on this journey together. Let's celebrate every fall as a new opportunity to rise. Join us and together, let us rise to the glory of living. Having understood the glory in rising, how do we put it into action? This is where the rubber meets the road, where theory turns into practice. It's one thing to understand the concept, it's another to live it out. Let's talk about practical steps and strategies that can empower you to embrace your falls and rise stronger in both your personal and professional life. First, it's important to acknowledge the fall. Denial only prolongs the pain. Acceptance, on the other hand, is the first step towards recovery. Next, 
Take a step back and reflect. What led to the fall? What could have been done differently? This isn't about dwelling on the past, but about learning from it. Then it's time to dust yourself off and get back on your feet. This could mean seeking help, either from a trusted friend, a mentor, or a professional. It could also mean taking time to heal, to regain your strength. But rising isn't just about getting back to where you were, it's about growing, becoming stronger, more resilient. So set new goals, challenge yourself, push beyond your comfort zone, incorporate this mindset into your daily routine. Make it a habit to rise, to grow, every single day. Little by little, step by step, you'll find yourself not just surviving, but thriving. And remember, you're not alone in this journey. Surround yourself with people who lift you up, who encourage you, who believe in your potential to rise. Lastly, don't forget to celebrate your victories, no matter how small they may seem. Each time you rise, you're one step closer to your greatest glory. So, are you ready to rise? To embrace your falls and rise stronger? To take on the challenges life throws your way and transform them into stepping stones towards your greatest glory? Remember, the journey to the greatest glory starts with a single step. So take that step. Start your journey today. The glory in action awaits you. As we conclude our journey today, let's carry with us a powerful thought. We've traversed the landscape of resilience, the terrain of determination, and the path of triumph. But the journey does not end here. It continues with each step we take, each decision we make, and each time we rise from a fall. Consider this a pearl of wisdom that has stood the test of time from the great philosopher Confucius. Our greatest glory is not in never falling, but in rising every time we fall. Let that sink in. It's not about the absence of failure, but the presence of resilience. It's not about a life without setbacks, but a spirit that refuses to be set back. Now imagine the ripple effect if we all embrace this wisdom. If we all decided to rise each time we fell, to dust ourselves off, to learn, to grow, to persevere. What a world that would be. A world where resilience is the norm and giving up is the exception. A world where every stumble is seen not as a dead end, but as a stepping stone towards glory. So let's commit to this philosophy of rising. Let's become the embodiment of the greatest glory. And let's not keep this enlightenment to ourselves. Share this video with someone who needs to hear this message. Encourage them to rise, inspire them to embrace the glory in falling and the power in rising. As we step out into the world, let's carry the glory of rising in our hearts. And remember, the world needs us to rise, not just to never fall. Let's make every fall a stepping stone to our greatest glory. Let's inspire others with our resilience, with our courage, with our unwavering spirit. Let's rise, and in doing so, let's lift the world with us.